Dorzolamide timolol drops are used to treat high pressure inside the eye due to glaucoma or other eye diseases, such as ocular hypertension. By lowering high pressure inside the eye, these drops help to prevent blindness. They work by decreasing the amount of fluid within the eye. Dorzolamide timolol drops contain two drugs, timolol, which belongs to a class of drugs called beta blockers, and dorzolamide, which belongs to a class of drugs called carbonic anhydrase inhibitors. The recommended daily dosage and the optimal timing for taking these drops should be determined by your healthcare provider. Before using dorzolamide timolol drops, make sure to read the patient information leaflet from your pharmacist. Use this medication in the affected eyes as directed by your doctor, usually one drop two times a day. To apply the eye drops, wash your hands first and avoid touching the dropper tip or letting it touch your eye or any other surface to prevent contamination. If you wear contact lenses, remove them before using the eye drops and wait at least 15 minutes before putting them back in. Tilt your head back, look upward, and pull down the lower eyelid to make a pouch. Hold the dropper directly over your eye and place one drop in your eye. Keep your eyes closed for 1-2 to two minutes and apply gentle pressure at the corner of your eye to prevent the medication from draining out. Repeat these steps for your other eye if directed. Do not rinse the dropper and replace the cap after each use. If you are using other eye medication, wait at least 5 minutes before applying dorzolamide timolol drops. Use this medication regularly at the same times each day to get the most benefit from it, even if you feel well. Most people with glaucoma or high pressure in the eyes do not feel sick. Possible side effects of using dorzolamide timolol drops include temporary blurred vision, burning, stinging, itching, redness, watery eyes, dry eyes, feeling like something is in your eye, sensitivity to light, a strange taste in the mouth, or headache. If any of these effects persist or worsen, notify your doctor or pharmacist promptly. It's important to remember that this medication has been prescribed to you because your doctor has determined that the benefits outweigh the potential risks. Many people who use this medication do not experience serious side effects. Contact your doctor immediately if you experience serious side effects such as dizziness, slow or irregular heartbeat, muscle weakness, changes in mental-slash-mood, numbness or pain in the hands or feet, changes in vision, signs of a kidney stone, yellowing of the eyes or skin, dark urine, unusual tiredness or weakness, easy bruising or bleeding, signs of infection, or very serious side effects such as eye redness or discharge that doesn't stop, eye or eyelid swelling, eye pain, sudden unexplained. Weight gain, chest pain, weakness on one side of the body, trouble speaking, confusion, severe dizziness, or fainting. While a serious allergic reaction to this medication is rare, seek immediate medical help if you notice any symptoms of a serious allergic reaction, including rash, itching or swelling of the face, tongue, or throat, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. This is not a complete list of possible side effects, so be sure to contact your doctor or pharmacist if you notice any other effects not listed here. If you are allergic to timolol slash dorzolamide, or if you have any other allergies, talk to your doctor or pharmacist before using this medication. This product may contain inactive ingredients that can cause allergic reactions or other problems. Before using this medication, let your doctor or pharmacist know about your medical history, especially if you have lung disease, irregular heartbeats, heart disease, kidney disease, liver disease, diabetes, overactive thyroid disease, muscle weakness disorders, low blood flow to the brain, or severe allergies. If you develop an eye infection or injury, or have eye surgery, check with your doctor about whether you should continue to use your current bottle of timolol slash dorzolamide. You may be advised to start using a new bottle. Before having surgery, inform your doctor or dentist about all the products you use, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. This product may prevent the fast-slash-pounding heartbeat you would usually feel when your blood sugar level falls too low. If you have diabetes, this medication may make it harder to control your blood sugar levels. Check your blood sugar levels regularly as directed by your doctor. After applying this drug, your vision may become temporarily blurred. Do not drive, use machinery, or do any activity that requires clear vision until you can do it safely. During pregnancy, this medication should be used only when clearly needed. Discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. Timolol passes into breast milk. 
It is unknown if dorzolamide passes into breast milk. Consult your doctor before breastfeeding. It's important to be aware of how dorzolamide timolol drops may interact with other medications you are taking. This can affect how well your medications work and may increase your risk of serious side effects. Make sure to keep a list of all the products you use, including both prescription and non-prescription drugs, and herbal products, and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. Don't start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. Some products that may interact with dorzolamide timolol drops include high doses of aspirin or related salicylates, oral beta blockers, oral carbonic and hydrase inhibitors, clonidine, certain antidepressants, digoxin, epinephrine, methyl dopa, and quinidine. If you are prescribed low-dose aspirin for specific medical reasons such as heart attack or stroke prevention, it's important to continue taking it as directed by your doctor. Be sure to consult your doctor or pharmacist for more details. As for the daily dosage of dorzolamide timolol drops, your doctor will provide specific instructions based on your individual needs. It's important to use this medication exactly as prescribed. Typically, the drops are used in the affected eyes twice a day, with the optimal timing being in the morning and evening. Be sure to follow your doctor's instructions carefully and ask any questions you may have about how to use this medication. If this medication is swallowed, it can be dangerous. If someone takes too much and experiences severe symptoms such as fainting or difficulty breathing, call 911 immediately. Otherwise, contact your local poison control center right away. In the US, you can call 1-800-222-1222, and in Canada, you can call a provincial poison control center. Symptoms of an overdose may include difficulty breathing or a slow or irregular heartbeat. It's important not to share your dorzolamide timolol drops with others. While using this medication, you may need to undergo lab or medical tests, such as eye exams. It's important to keep all medical and lab appointments, so make sure to consult your doctor for more details on when and how often you should be getting these tests. If you forget to take a dose of dorzolamide timolol drops, take it as soon as you remember. If it's almost time for your next dose, just skip the missed dose and continue with your regular schedule. Don't take a double dose to make up for the missed one. It's important to take your medication at the same time every day for the best results. When using dorzolamide timolol drops, it is important to store them at room temperature away from light. If using single-use containers, keep them inside the pouch and discard any unused ones 15 days after opening the pouch. The solution is normally colorless, so if it changes color, becomes cloudy, or develops particles, it should be discarded. Make sure to keep all medications away from children and pets. It is important to properly discard this product and it is expired or no longer needed. Do not flush medications down the toilet or pour them into a drain unless instructed to do so. It's best to consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the proper way to dispose of the medication. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.